for all our hypers. And in honor of Christmas, we kept it festive in the colors. Now, if you can, I want you to take out the pink OMG packet and let's find our Miss Piggy. Let's see. It says OMG. Okay. Turn till you find that cow. I mean pig. <laughs> Miss Piggy. Find Miss Piggy, half the battle is won. The easy is the second page. The easiest or third, third page, maybe. There you go. Uh, now, the easiest way to know your electrolytes until the day you die is, of course, to know Miss Piggy. If you look at Miss Piggy, she helps you remember what numbers are more high, what numbers are more low. So, of course, it says Miss Piggy and Kermit came home on cloud nine. The word nine reminds you that there are nine entries or labs. However, the third one is an ampersand sign. So, if you look at these nine, they're all electrolytes except for number three which is an ampersand sign, and you don't care other than to remember you got to put in a filler there. Then, if you look at the first letter of each word, it's an electrolyte. Miss, the M is magnesium. The P, the P is phosphorus. The E, I mean the K is potassium for Kermit. The CA is calcium. The H is bicarb, the N is O2, the CL is chloride, and the N at the bottom is sodium. It doesn't get any better than this, because watch this. If you go to the very top and look at the first, no, what in the hell is you doing? Okay, because we lost your little ass on Tuesday or Monday, whatever it is. Okay, child, I can find some of y'all. Some of y'all out there lost. Okay, here we go. If you look at the M for magnesium and you look at the first number, not the last number in the range, just the first number, it's going to go in order. 1.5, next one. 2.5, next one. 3.5, ampersand sign was before that. The next number gets bigger, it's 8. The next number, 22, I know you're, um, I know it can be, uh, what did your dad in school have? Yeah, some bullshit. Okay, so anyway, whatever. But you can see how the number gets bigger, can't you? 22, right? And then you keep on going. Look at that, 90, 90, and even bigger, 130 something. Now, here's the fun part. If you are sitting in my class and you don't know that oxygen is 95 to 100, we're going to have a problem. So that's going to be right in between there helping you out because you already know that one. After much turmoil and disgust and arguments with teachers, you even know bicarb. Because there's a 22 or there's a 21. Well, I won my book says it's 22, but oh, you guys said it's going to. I remember. Trust me, it happens every semester. So you're going to know some of these already. But the wonderful part about the ones you really don't know, just go with the letters. I can promise you, after four years at Ursuline, two years at Case for Masters, and now my PhD, I don't fucking remember mag and phosphorus. And I think I'm pretty good. I don't, but I know my Miss Pinky because I learned it at Ursuline. So I can remember all the Miss Piggy shit you want to throw at me. I can just, I can run it off because of this. So as we go over here to a hypercalcemia, of course it's greater than 10 because you know you're Miss Piggy, okay? It's not an 80% in there or 72 or anything goofy. It's in the beginning of the Miss Piggy. 